Yeah, welcome. Hello, Mr. Tayetaivo. Hello, 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 hello. How is life in Milano? Ah, uh, it was very fine, thank you. I'm glad that uh, finally we can spoke on talk together, at least to finalize everything. So I'm very glad to have you back here to have ourselves on conversation like this. So, so good. yeah. Yeah, well, of course, I'm very happy to welcome you to Salo next season uh, to play play in our great project here. You're a huge signing to all the football fans in Salo. So let's just start. You have played in all the biggest leagues in Europe. You've been to Finland, of course, before, and you have been uh, been to other places uh, in between your last visit to Finland. But why come back to Finland? What made you think about coming back to Finland at, at, in the first place? Because why I decided to come back to Finland is because uh, I really like uh, Finnish people, though. So, you know, so like uh, because uh, they are very easy people, and uh, they don't make things very difficult. They allow things because they are not kind of person that like to put on pressure on somebody. They just allow you to do whatever you want to do. Feel free if you know exactly what you are doing. So that's why I decided like it's better for me at least to come back to Finland. So as I hear from the project that you guys. You're trying to do then I say okay because I like projects. If I hear anything projects, I always on it so that if you start projects, we can do good things so that the thing can go up. This is what I like most for my life anyway. So yeah. that's why I decided to come back to Finland. Yeah, Finland is the greatest country in the earth. <laughs> oh, Finland, <laughs> Finland and Nigeria and Italy maybe. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Hey, you you had of course you had offers from higher leagues and other countries too. So why did you you already talked about the project that we offered you? But uh, what was the what was the one thing that made you decide that okay I'm going to Salo to play in the third year in Finland? What was the deciding factor behind that thinking? Because when you when you decide something like uh, because if you go, I'm coming to Salo to come and play, I played Vegas League before because I try to do something like the name I have, but everywhere I go, I just want the name to continue to win the bell. If I play first division, play second division, whatever league you play, I just want like my name to continue to win the bell everywhere. Because if you are doing projects in one place, if you go to the place, if you guys, by God's grace, you do good things, everything, everybody's happy, they will surely put your name everywhere. So that's what I decided like, to come to, to come and play. So at least to help the young one that is growing up also, with my capacity to have so that we can put ourselves as a team and the fans also, so everybody will be very happy. Yeah, yeah, that sounds good. That, that's what we talked about during the negotiations about your role in the team. Of course, you, you've seen it all. You, you won things. You know, played in the biggest leagues with the biggest players. And you, your, one of your goals was to be a role model also for the younger players in Salo and see how the real professionals train and, and maybe pass your experience to the younger players and also for the current players. Of course, there's a lot of good players in Salo. So, what are your expectations, like personal expectations, of your role in the team in the upcoming season? Because coming season, uh, I get a lot of stuff in my left shoulder and my right shoulder now. So, like, uh, I need to to defend a lot of things, even though the young one and the old one and the coaches and you as the the boss of the team as well. So, at least we need to work in hand together as family, so that to bring everybody hard together. Because to get to three points in a game is hard work. You can't just yeah. go hard and say, okay, like, Tai Tai is going to be the one of the, to shoot the goal key, to score the penalty. I still have everybody around. We need to work as a team. So that is why, like, at least, for example, I'm very happy we see have a couple of times so that we can have a good player that is coming and so that we can, at least, to make everybody as a family, as we did before in Europe. Because when I was there, I said, okay, like, we have to do ourselves like a family so that we can get good things out. Yeah, and, and that's the one message that we've been also like emphasizing on that this is going to be a family thing, so to speak. We have to work really hard for the team, for the fans, for everybody in the city of Salo, you know, make everybody proud of our, our Swans family as the, the team is known, the Swans. So that, that's the one message. Happy to, happy to have you part of that. And what is your overall message to the people who are following football in Salo? What 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 can they expect, expect of Taya next season? Because for me, in Salo now, because when I don't like to, to say, okay, I want to do that. I just like to like, to continue working, at least by God great, to give me the more strength so that I can be 100%, so that I can bring myself out, so that like, to show the people, say, I'm still there, I can even run around to make, to achieve good things again in life. So this is one of the messages I will pass to the Salo people that uh, I'll be coming, 
with a lot of uh, strength, with a lot of happiness for the everybody, with the coaches, with you as well. So the people, at least we can be, to put smile in everybody's my face, at least by God's grace, I think we can achieve good things. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So I think the main, main thing is that you said that word a lot during our conversations in the video, the happiness and the family. I guess those are two things that Taya will bring, bring to the <laughs> solar piece to yourself. <laughs> absolutely, yeah, okay. absolutely. So, yeah, so one last thing. What, what's your message to all your teammates in solo for the upcoming season? Or not? Uh, for me, my teammates, I always say this word anyway, like um, we need to, like, my new team and I as well is to arrive there. Don't look me like, okay, because I'm tired. I'm still one of your teammates. We are just normal person. So that you can be free, whatever you want to ask me, you're free to ask. Then I will give you the response. Well, because if I give you a very good example on the field or outside the field, you'll be very happy. So, okay, I really like to work with this guy because I'm a person that I don't like to lose. I love to win. But if I want to win, I need to work hard to get the three points. If I lose a game, I always like, very hungry. We can't win every game. We will lose some game. We will draw some game. But the most important thing, we should try and give what we have in our belly to bring it outside so that people they will be they will appreciate. So, wow, these boys they are really fantastic. They are really trying their best. So that is why, like, uh, the message I want to pass to my team is that uh, we should work in hand as a family. Then I'm help. I will be out there to help the the whatever people I need to help on the field if you're playing or outside the field or if you're on the bench, whatever. To so just bring a good message for everybody. At least the most important thing is to just put our smile, to be smiling also so that we can get good things out. Yeah. So one last thing for everybody thinking you it's been a while since you were in Finland, and of course, there's been the coronavirus and everything in between, which has halted the football all around the world. So in what kind of shape are you at the moment and how you've been keeping yourself fit at at this time during this time? Yeah, because uh, I'm a professional football player. Not just only in the field, outside of the field also, because I know exactly what to do. So because I'm not just because of the the coffee, I'll just stop myself out in the home. So I've been training with me with the club here in Milan. I went to training yesterday. So at least uh, we played 10 to 10 yesterday. It was very nice training. So this is what I used to do every week. We start training on Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday. Then tomorrow, Saturday, we just do a little training not so hard so i just to sweat a little bit so that at least on tuesday we start so that is why i only keep myself in good shape so that if i come to salon i will not be able to so yeah i need to start running like maybe 100 meters before i get fixed so at least to just maybe to train for like two weeks i will get the the reading mode because i've been playing football here also it's not maybe i'm training alone i'm training with the club so because the it's because why they allow me to train with them but when the coach see that i'm kind of person like you allow me to train because uh, I make everybody smile, even though I don't play again much with them. But at least training, I'll do some funny things so people will be laughing. So that's my life. So this is what I really appreciate that God gave me this friend that if I'm one place, I only make everybody happy so that we can bring joy out of what we're doing. Yeah, so there's going to be a lot of joy and happiness in Salo next season. There. <laughs> Absolutely. <laughs> yeah. So you're Absolutely. In, uh, in March next year coming to Finland, so everybody will be waiting for you. So happy to have you in Salo for next season. We're going to do some very good and some happy things together. So happy Absolutely. To <laughs> yeah. Happy to have you, Taya. Welcome to Salo. Thank you very much. I'm very glad that uh, you give me the opportunity to come and join Salo as a football club in Finland. So, because this is where I really appreciate you. I appreciate the coach. Then I appreciate all my new teammates and the fans all there in, uh, in Finland. They will be expecting me as I'll be expecting them too. So I'll be glad to come back to home in Finland, second home. So I'll see you soon in Salo and good luck. Thanks. All right then.